so this just arrived today been waiting for it since they announced it I don't know why it seemed like the uh, the coolest thing they announced back in in September um, this is the box pretty standard echo box has a nice flap to come undone Sorry, I'm not a professional unboxer either. Clock itself. It's more of a white. In the pictures, it looks more silver, but it actually has kind of a white feeling. Uh, I mean, definitely feels. I mean, it's not super cheap, but I mean, it's a wall clock. $30, whatever. So it says, don't poke it. That's what that means. So, anyways, let's see if I can get this off. On the back, looks like you have mounting hardware. You have the other stuff here for the batteries and sync button. And then the clock itself. So, you can put it next to second gen echo or second gen echo show just for size comparison so anyways I'll have to get this set up and then see uh, see what it's all about all right so gonna install the batteries and then try to pair this so we'll see what happens so Alexa set up my echo wall clock okay Press and hold the pairing button on the back of your Echo wall clock for up to 10 seconds until the light on the clock's face pulse is orange. Pairing may take up to a minute, and the light will turn blue once paired. You can also pair or unpair your clock in the Alexa app under the Bluetooth settings of your Echo device. Hopefully it doesn't roll away. Come back. Your Echo wall clock is paired. It will take a few minutes to set your clock to the time of your Echo device. Once the time is set, you can hang your clock using the mounting hardware provided. When you're ready, try setting a timer or ask, what can Echo wall clock do? That's cool. It's automatically adjusting the time. Well, that's going to take a while. I'm going to need to fast forward this. I think it'd be smart enough just to go to the right time. Okay, have the... Uh Echo Clock set up, all the software's up to date. Um, just wanted to give kind of a quick demo on you know the different features, which is pretty much just timers. Um, I guess also if you have a notification, the uh, the little light LED light will will notify you with a yellow yellow light. So I guess timers and notifications. Um, but just to give you kind of a quick quick demo, um, if you have any echo devices right now I would put them on mute um, but just here we go uh, Alexa set a timer for 30 seconds 30 seconds starting now and you saw that it actually did catch back up um, so you know as the the timer comes down it also counts down on the clock visually which is cool um, you know once the the timer's done then uh, the actual clock itself will, will flash for that specific timer. So we'll just let this finish here. Um, if you want to do multiple timers, uh, Alexa, set a timer for one minute. One minute, starting now. And as you can see, for the minute, it's going to take up the entire circle uh, to count down from from 60 seconds. Uh, Alexa, set a timer for 10 minutes. 
Second timer, 10 minutes, starting now. So with the second timer, it's a little bit more tricky. I don't know if you can see it, but the uh, 10 minute mark here. So when you set it for longer than a minute, these tick marks here all count as a minute. So it starts at 10 minutes here, uh, and eventually that will count down to one minute, and then the one minute will go all the way down to the zero as it is kind of doing now. Um, you can set a third timer. You know, Alexa, set a timer for 45 minutes. Third timer, 45 minutes, starting now. And you'll see that it'll show up on the on the other side. Um, so I'll just let this one go down, and then I'll, I'll cancel the other two. So definitely get your attention when it's uh, when it's done. So. So, Alexa, cancel all timers. Canceling but all your timers. Just wanted to give you a quick demo of the uh, the new Echo Echo Clock. Uh, said I'm going to be using it more for for cooking and, and keeping a tracks keeping track of those things. Um, maybe if the kid gets unruly, give him a nice timeout timer too. So, all right, bye.